Hello friends, welcome back to our session. So, in the previous session we have seen a program which handles the mouse events and in this session we will see another program which handles the key events. See, in order to implement these key events, two things should be added. One is key event class Another one is key listener interface. Key event class and key e listener interface. So here, what are the possible events? So possible events are key pressed event. key released event key typed event so three events are there three events are possible for this key key uh, events so those three are key pressed key released and key type and in order to so these are the abstract methods available in this key listener interface as we have discussed just uh, in the previous session so so in order to implement this one, we have to take the help of key, key event class. So in this key event class, there is a method called get key care. This is the method which is used to get the key of the character which is type. Right? So whenever the event is generated, that event will be so C. Whenever the event is generated, that event will be transferred to this key listener interface where we are writing the definition for all the possible key events. So, key press, key release, and key type. Because all these are the abstract methods available in the interface. So, these definitions will be written, and with the help of key event class, we can handle the key events. Right? So, here also we can follow the same template which we have discussed in the previous session. So, first we have to import the packages and then we have to extend the applet and implement the interface. So here the interface is key listener interface. So here we have to implement the key listener interface and then we have to write the applet code and then we have to write the init method. So init method, uh, we can set the foreground, set the background and we have to register the interface with the event source, right? So here the event listener is key event listener key listener right so that should be registered with the key events and then in the uh, the definition of all the possible key events which are available in key listener interface and then we have to write the pin method so our applet program always starts its execution from init method so once the init method is executed then automatically the paint method will be called and that paint method will be generated so whenever the key event is occurred automatically that that event will be transferred to the key listener interface and in the key listener interface these possible events definitions will be done and according to the logic and according to the uh, code we have written in the program that code will be executed right so hope you understood these key events we have to follow the same format and a for, uh, template so we'll stop here and uh, we will see the implementation part in the system so that your doubts will be clarified hello friends so in the just now we have seen the key events so now let us see the program to handle the key events so just we will follow the same template so there are three possible events key events that is key pressed key released and key typed now let us see this one so first we have to import this one import java dot awt package so in that we can get both the events and the graphics package next we have to use applet java dot applet next we have to write the applet code just we will write the applet code here so applet code is equal to key width is equal to some 600 height is equal to some 500 
right now let us close the applet now let us create a class public class key which extends the applet and implements key listener so here we are using the key key events so key listener so just write the message uh, let us display the message here so key events right now so let us take uh, two parameters int ex is equal to 40 y is equal to 40 now write down the init method public void init so here we can uh, go with the set background set foreground set background is equal to black sorry sorry color dot black similarly set foreground is the of color dot uh, little bit yellow and then we have to add this one add key listener of this so we have completed it now we have to write the definition for all these three events so public void key pressed so we have to make use of key event class ke write down message is equal to key pressed set background so color dot pink and show status key pressed next public void key released key event ke message is equal to key released now set the background in different color set background color dot red show status key released right public void key type so there is one more event that is key type key event ke so here key type we can write uh, message is equal to key type right and then we can also give message plus is equal to so there is a command called uh, ke dot uh, method called get key care right next, uh, next here also we can set background color color dot black show status key type okay now let us write the paint method public void paint graphics drawstring g dot drawstring message comma x comma y 
yeah here we have to write the repaint method okay repaint so this should be included in everything so that the paint method will be called one again and again right right now let us uh, execute this one key dot java let us execute this one so java c dot key dot java so once uh, message is equal to enter right so we didn't initialize here i think so yes so string message yes now you can get while parsing yes we didn't close the class public class key listener error cannot find the key listener so just we will also implement the event class import java dot a w t dot event dot start yes so explicitly we have to write the import method for uh, importing this event package also now let us execute this one applet where key dot java see key events so whenever the mouse is i mean key is pressed key typed is j key released right so if you observe here after pressing here key released key typed key pressed key release okay so whenever you are pressing the key automatically key typed is executed first key pressed is executing and then immediately key really key typed is also executing okay now see i will show you if okay so this is the program for key events see once again i will show you so whenever you press a key automatically key pressed is implemented and immediately key typed is also executed you, i am pressing j i am pressing h i am pressing i i am pressing r i am pressing f right so and I, immediately after releasing this key it will be released key released right hope you understood this one right so if you are having any doubts regarding this key events feel free to post your doubts in the comment section so that i will definitely try to clarify all your doubts and just we have to follow the templates so remember this this should be implemented explicitly right right even dot star and then applet code and extends the applet class extends the applet and implements a key listener and then we have to write the init in the init we have to register the event listener key listener and then uh, we have to write the definition for all the possible events which are available in this key listener interface right hope your doubts has been clarified now and uh, if you really understood my session like my sessions share my sessions with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thanks for watching thank